welcome people good on the side so we are back again today we are looking at this scene and uh, this is uh, the scene done by my friend as you must know i just know no 3d so uh, yeah this is the scene done by my friend ankit and uh, he's a very talented artist he just did an awesome job in this interior shot see the texture oh god i love it so yeah i just made it to look like a kind of a mood kind of a scene because uh, just as per my taste as it's not for any client it's it's just for our personal work so i did this so let's get started this is the raw render huh, as you can see uh, it's a kind of a bright scene um, obviously we can make it to the different moods as we want but uh, i just made it a little dark and moody kind of a scene you can also made it a little bright uh, and uh, kind of a morning kind of a scene but i just made it a little dark as per my taste so yeah you just here to know the techniques and what basically i did and uh, how i did it so yeah let's get started so this is what we are going to make and this was the raw render this was what we are going to do okay but before starting just uh click on the subscribe button if you are not subscribed on this channel yet because here i will provide a very useful information on post production thing just click on the subscribe button and uh, click on this little bell icon and here send all notification for this channel so that you can have a notification when i'm giving a new tutorial and so that you can have a notification when i will upload a new tutorial so click on save and that's it you will have a notification also you can visit my facebook page here i will provide a new uh, tutorials and my completed scene for my personal use uh, my, my personal scene as well as the scene i did for a client click on like button and yep here we go so firstly what i did is the background it's a, just a normal uh, image it, it's just an image uh, from some uh, from some psd library i guess yeah and what i did here is i just choose the render id and from the render id this is the render id i choose the I, I pick up the white color and as here it's my image uh, let me let me delete it and do it for you again this is the image for the background and just layer mask it so here we go this is the sky same this is the extra text from the 3d itself and uh, just to give little dark edges and a mood kind of a scene and this is the very lighting just uh, darkening it by by normal curves just red value i just took up the red value up and yeah and this is the raw reflect reflection from the passage itself and uh, this is the curves i just make it little no not little a uh, very dark because i will i know i will uh, correct it later on so just a normal curves by select it's a uh, mask of this frame and by just kind of correcting it as per your taste that's how it's looking good or not and uh, then let me show you this is the all curves nothing else just normal curves and adjusting the color of it this is the plant and again adjusting the color according to your taste nothing much so the next what i did is is the fog or kind of a sunlight from the window it's kind of a gaudy race kind of a thing just a, a normal paint one just like this i just took a white color brush and just paint it like this as simple as that and make it on the screen and loading down the opacity so this is what i did so yeah again next is vignetting a uh, little vignetting and rest all i did is color correction from the selective colors color balance hue saturation etc so this is the selective colors and i just use the different color values uh, by just eyeballing it like you have to do as per your need like whatever whatever is looking good to you or your eye or whatever is uh, feeling a uh, little real kind of thing it's not real uh, by the way it's uh, just for my personal days i did this scene uh, not for any client or something so i just i just uh, tweak the color values and that's it so this is the color value i got from after after just adjusting these colors and the next is 
color look up okay color sorry color balance yeah it's a color balance again just uh, eyeballing it like whatever feels you whatever feels good to you just do it this is color look up and yeah it's on 43 opacity and uh, I just I just choose um, film stock or uh, film stock for 50 yeah, here we go film stock 30 point fifth sorry 50.3 D L okay it's this one I choose this one and on 43% opacity rest is color color curves okay yeah because the dark because the there's a lot of shadow area in in this scene there's a lot of shadow area so I just brighten up by just uh, removing the darkness and the black values I just remove the black values by taking this curves little up from here and that's it hue saturation just to give it uh right now it's, it's kind of a very uh, saturated color so hue saturation is a must, must for this so i just took down the saturation as well as i put this on soft light so this is without soft light it's also kind of a good scene like good uh, neutral color scene but i just boosted up the color by soft light and okay this is a uh, kitten i added for us for the scene but uh, someone told me that it's not looking good oh come on but for me it's it's very cute it's looking very cute let's let's see her eyes <laughs> but uh, i haven't kept it in a final shot so just remove it the next is it's just normal curves and uh, again i took the black value up for the corners as i feel like magnetic is getting too much overpowering in this scene and uh, then it's again a uh, little not little actually it's a, a, a fog a kind of a rays a kind of environment you can say just to boosten it up so yeah this is what i did and yeah this is what i did so guys uh thank you for watching make sure to subscribe my channel and give it a thumbs up if you like it please share it as well as comment below if you have uh, anything how do you feel like about this tutorial or what what else you want me to show yeah do share it because i'm just creating a new channel for you guys i just want to make a good community here by providing all the information all the things i have i, I learned in my life and uh, i want to share with you guys so yeah thank you so much bye bye take care see you next time